They call me Cheese because I have the best smile on the team. Cheese. I'm from Brooklyn and the Bronx. My mom and dad separated. I remember myself being in my dad's apartment, a New York City small apartment. My dad put a basketball room up in an apartment. Imagine a New York City apartment, really small. Put a basketball court up for me. I'm a son, he loves me. So like he put a basketball court up. I'm just playing like I'm playing professionally, like talking to myself while he's sleeping. Um, in apartments, people downstairs always knocking on the door telling me to be quiet. But my dream was so big, I saw myself there already as a kid. And that's what drove me to become where I'm at now. Just never giving up on your dream. My dad just always infused that, that fight, that will, go get buckets. But long story short, I went to prep school after high school. One of my toughest challenges was being um, under-recruited because colleges, they always thought I was undersized, you know? I'm just too skinny. But until they see me play, people think I'm weak, I'm not. I know how to use my body. I know how to use my strength to the best of my abilities. I ended up being ranked in the nation, which led me to go to college, to go to Ball State University. Sometime in life, you have that question mark where you don't know what you're gonna do. My major was communication and mass media. I was still trying to get a professional job. I didn't know what I was gonna do at the time, but I knew I wanted to play basketball. I played basketball my whole life. My godfather, he got me a connect to the Globetrotters and had a tryout. Before I became a Globetrotter, I didn't know no tricks whatsoever. And the trial was extensive basketball for hours. They want to see how good you are as a basketball player first before they invest time in you. And I came in the gym and I shot the lights out. So I don't think I missed a shot that day. What, what makes the Globe Trial so special is that they, um, they catered to what they need as an organization. And I fit the criteria for what they were looking for at the time. They were looking for shooters. And it was a great, a great opportunity for me. It's important for you to have a dream. Everybody needs motivation. Dreams aren't dreams, they're goals, if you put them in perspective. You set yourself a goal, so even if it's not sports, if you, if you want to be a doctor, teacher, lawyer, whatever your dream is, just have dedication towards it. A lot of hours, extensive hours. Um, for basketball, I would say in the gym. Um, you have to have perseverance, you have to have passion, um, uh, and you just have to put all those things in one pot and just never give up on it. It kind of hit me really, really late. Like, it's just like, okay, I'm about to go to practice with the Harlem Globetrotters. I'm about to go to practice with Harlem. I'm really about to go, like when we got our uniforms and the bag of stuff, like I just looked at it and I was just like, this is real. I'm really here. 